as you probably surmised by the hairband, it is face mask review time again. So we're doing one by Hey Honey today, which is always a spendy brand, so <laughs> strap in. This is the Sweet Treat Wild Berry and Honey Yogurt Recovery Mask. It restores the appearance of dull skin impacted by environmental stressors. So what I have is like the deluxe sample size from Ipsy. They do sell it in two sizes. Like this one that I have is like half an ounce, but the two sizes they sell, there's a one ounce version. Get ready. $27. There's two and a half ounce version. $48. So, um, spendy. Spendy. It totally, I thought it was just the colloidal glowed one by the same brand that was hella spendy. Oh no, 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 this is just how this brand is apparently, so. Whoo, liquid gold apparently. So, it's cruelty free, SLS free, paraben free. Um, what is that over there? Well, if it weren't pale pink on white, maybe I'd be able to read it. I think it's how many months after opening, nine months after opening. But I haven't opened it yet. So, 15 minutes to new skin. Um, for more info, you have to go to their website because it doesn't fit on this size. So, let me just... There it is. I was like, where's the little pull tab for the foil? Um, come on, you. Alright. So, for everybody who shits on Ipsy for giving out these little sample sizes, um, there's a lot more value to them than you think a lot of times, actually. Okay, come on now. So I pulled off the foil, but there's still very clearly, like, a wax layer over it. Why me? Oh my god, I'm trying to... Alright, I think I've about got it. Yeah, there we go. Any, <laughs> So, I don't really smell anything, so let's just... Oh, it's pink! I don't know why I'm surprised by that. It does, in fact, look like yogurt. <laughs> uh, do not let your pets get to it. It contains xylitol, which is hella toxic to pets. Fair warning. I was looking at the ingredients list and noticed that, so I always give the disclaimer on anything that contains that. Oh, it has a little smell. It does smell like yogurt. That is trippy. That's so weird. Okay, let's... Ooh. Oh, that feels... Oh, wow. That is the weirdest thing. Like, it legit does feel like yogurt. Oh, my God. It even has, like, little seeds in it like yogurt. I guess that's from the wild berries. Like, can you see them? There's little bitty seeds in there. <laughs> that's wild. All right. I don't know which kinds of berries they used in here, but, like, <laughs> that's kind of cool, actually. That's a nice touch. I like that. Because it's not like that elf one, the cookies and cream, where they were, like, faking the effect of cookie bits. This is, like, actual berry seeds. And this literally glides on, like, butter. It feels so good putting it on. Yeah, you can see some of the seeds there. Wow. Just there so we don't waste. My only concern with those berries is worrying, are they going to clog my pores? I hope they don't, but also wouldn't be surprised if it happens. Like, deadass, I would not be surprised if that happens. Trying to get in here before I did the nose, but I missed, so I was like, eh, we'll go with it. We'll go with it. That little area there is always so hard to hit. Ah, oh, boy, okay. I think I'm gonna have enough to use it a second time, too, which is nice. I wasn't expecting that for how little it was. But then again, that gold one from this brand? Like, I've gotten a bunch of uses out of each tube, so... Oh, okay. Are they seeds, or are they something else? Because those are, like, just smearing. What the hell is that? 
it's mildly concerning. Like, what the hell's going on there? This isn't Ash Wednesday. Why do I have black on my forehead? It is a Wednesday, though. <laughs> In general. Okay. So I'm going to recap that. I'm going to set my timer and we will come back in 15 minutes and I will let you know how my skin is feeling. I am noticing like the slightest tingliness, not like burning, not like a reaction feeling, just slight tingliness like it's doing something. So that's always good to see because sometimes you put it on, it's like, is it even doing anything? I don't really know. Did I just waste my money? I don't know. But this feels like it's probably doing something. So we'll check back. Okay, so I washed it off, and I have to say, that was a very refreshing mask to do. That slight tingliness lasted the whole time that it was on. It never got uncomfy. It never got, like, strong enough to think, oh, is this, like, a reaction? No, no. Just, like, tingly, like, active ingredients in there or something. Even though, look at the ingredients, I'm like, not sure that there's anything in there that I can see that would do that. But then again, of all the fruit extracts in there, it could have just been, like, the natural processes of those. But... It felt really good, and especially on a warm day, like, that honestly felt amazing. And thankfully this one washed off relatively easy, which, by contrast to, like, the last one or two I've done lately, I'm like, yeah, yeah, this is much better. <laughs> so, oh man, it's just a shame that it costs as much as it does, because if it weren't so spendy, I would buy more of this one, like, straight up, like... Honestly, I like it. Like, if I should ever see it on sale through Ipsy or BoxyCharm or something, I, I might just have to grab it. I might just have to grab it. But yeah, so if you're cool with spending that much on a face mask, I, I think this is a pretty solid one. Like, honestly, my skin feels so soft and, like, nourished after that. Like, and I mean, you see, I haven't even applied my other skincare yet. Just the natural glow. Like, yes. Yes bring it. <laughs> so I think it's a good one. So anyways, those are my thoughts. So anywho, uh, you know what to do. If you like this video, go ahead and give it a like. If you're not already and you'd like to be, click subscribe, hit that notification bell icon so you never miss an upload. Leave comments down below. Make sure you're following my social media accounts, my Facebook fan page, my Twitter, my Instagram, my eBay, my Reddits, everything and more. It's all down below. And if you'd like what I do here on this channel and you'd like to help support it, the donation link as always is down in the description. Anyway guys, till next time, see ya.